Before viewing this video, it is recommended that you first view the video working with digital frames in order to understand the basics of the process. In this tutorial, we will cover the layered PSD frame templates. These templates are characterized by an intact background with multiple overlays within the background. Once you have your desired frame selected, open your subject files that you wish to apply. Click on the Move tool, then place your cursor over the first subject image left click and hold to drag over to the template. For a less cluttered workspace, go to the layers palette and click on the eye to the left of the element not being used right now. This will make them invisible until needed later. To make it easier to properly locate your subject over the frame overlay, go to the layers palette and reduce the opacity a little so that you can see the overlay behind it. Odds are that your subject will not be the same size as the intended frame overlay to be used. Click Ctrl plus the letter T to bring up the free transformation edit points. Now resize your subject to the overlay. You can rotate the image as well by placing your cursor over the outside of the corner edit points. Once you have your subject properly positioned, go back to the layers palette and select the overlay layer. Now select the magic wand tool, make sure your tolerance is fairly low to medium and the contiguous box is unchecked. Place your cursor over the outside of the frame overlay and click to create a selection of the entire image minus the area covered by the overlay. Go back to the layers palette and select your subject layer. Now click control plus the letter X to cut out the outside edges of your subject. Increase the opacity back to 100%. Delete the overlay layer just used. Click on your next overlay's eye icon to make it visible and repeat the process. Another thing to keep in mind is the only difference between our senior frames and a frame usable for any other purpose is the change or elimination of the editable layer. This format allows for three different functions. You can use it as the intended frame, a standalone background, or use the overlays on a different background of your choice. If you have any questions about this or any other process, feel free to contact us anytime using our contact page.